Okay, here we go with our pie crust. Two cups of sifted flour. And Robin Hood flour. Your favorite. Yeah, <laughs> my favorite. And I use a teaspoon of salt. Mm-hmm. This is the Crisco crust. This is the Crisco. So you have to get this all blended together with your pastry blender. Nice and crumbly. Nice and crumbly. We're gonna add the cold water. Just stir it around with your fork till it gets all sticky together. I think this is pretty sticky. Well, let me put a couple of little drips in there. Hopefully it will be all right. Bit of flour on my hands. Mix, makes two nice pie crusts. You can add to one if you think the other one's bigger. Get them pretty even. Let's see. Eh, that looks pretty good. I might have taken too much. Sometimes I do that. <laughs> you don't use a scale. Yeah, we don't need a scale. No. You'll be fine. Now we're going to roll out and we got to get enough flour on here and some on your pin, your rolling pin. And then I like to make a nice circle so it rolls out nice. Mm -hmm. Then put a little bit on the bottom and a little bit on the top so it doesn't stick to your rolling pin. You don't worry about putting too much flour? No, I don't. It'll be fine. You really probably do, you know, you just throw it on. Mm -hmm. Make sure you don't have it stick into your rolling pin. And then I do mine this way because it's easier for me. And I need this one first. Your milk. So I pick that up, put it in my dish and then I have to turn my corners under or my edges under. Some days they just roll out better than other days. Mm -hmm. It's a nice day today so I don't know if that has anything to do with it or not. Just turn all these edges in under and then when you get them all in under then we'll crimp it. Now we're going to crimp just some people crimp this way and some have a different way they like to do. This one's easy for me, so I just use my fingers and thumbs. Okay. That looks good. There we go. Sounds good. Today we're decorated oh, yeah, for I St. Had... Patty's Day. <laughs> yeah. Last time I was here, you were full on decorated for fall Thanksgiving. Yes. That's right. Papa. Papa loves it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. If I didn't do it, he would miss it because he loves all the lights and everything. Yeah. If nobody else enjoys it, we do. <laughs> well, you got to do it because you like it too. Mm hmm. I do. And, as, and if you want to check to make sure it's big enough, just put your plate over it. And if you think you still have overhang after you get it down in the middle, Nothing there good. won't be a lot of overhang. But, but let me try to do That's this. That's a good up. tip. Yes. You're going to have to make sure, though, that you have enough to get down in the middle. So pull that back. I did have these all wiped off. Put your... I like to pick mine up and do it. It's easier for me. See, I still have enough to hang over the edge. Mm -hmm. This one's a little thin right here, but I'll work that out. Okay, we're gonna crimp this. So you're blind. 
baking. Line it. bake it for 20 minutes. So you don't have to worry about this edge getting very dark because it won't. Do you put anything inside the pie or do you poke four I punch holes? holes in it. Yeah, you dock And even it. though you're filling it, that doesn't matter. Nothing will go through. It's fine. Yeah. The wind. Looks good. Mm -hmm. Now I'll take my fork and just punch holes in the bottom. Just so, so it doesn't puff up when you're blind baking. Mm -hmm. Otherwise yeah. you'll have this big puffed. Do the sides too a little yeah, bit? do the sides the whole way around. Let's, and they won't puff out. Let your steam escape. Yep. Right. So we're going to blind bake this at 350 for 20 minutes. And then how long do you let it cool? Um, I, I like it to be cool. Completely it, cool. It doesn't take long to cool a crust like this. Okay. But probably at least a half an hour to cool it. Plenty of time to make the... Oh, yeah. The filling. The filling doesn't take long at all. All right. So we're going to bake it now. Mm -hmm. Okay. 350 for 20 minutes. All right. So it's done. It's puffed. Yeah. Not much. It'll, that'll, that'll fall down. Not much color on it. Nice and tender. Good. <laughs>